Let's talk about gambling for a second. It's so easy for those new to advertising to look at it in the same category as gambling. Well, you're launching the campaign, crossing your fingers for that lucky number seven. But if gambling was all luck, how do professional card players consistently beat the odds? It's the exact same way that advertisers create winning ads. It comes from studying the subtleties of human psychology. Of what makes people do things, why do they buy? Now following this format allows these pros to consistently beat the odds and deliver massive returns. My name is Shane Harder and I'm the founder of Mysterious Media. We're just a small, nimble team of creatives, and I'm personally extremely proud to have been able to create ad content for some of the world's largest corporations, contributing millions to their bottom line, sometimes directly, but sometimes together with other, other media companies. Now, although we've been lucky enough to work on some larger campaigns, we still love working on campaigns for smaller businesses as well. Now, one thing I've noticed is that oftentimes media companies who work with larger corporations become really out of budget for smaller companies. We, however, believe that smaller companies should have the same opportunity for growth that larger companies get. So I've created a pricing tier uh, for every budget. For this, I'll be referencing the document right here that I created, which can be found on the link in the video description below. So feel free to go to that link, download it there and follow along. Um, I'll be sharing media examples that are also going to correspond with the different production levels. So this gives you a really clear idea of really what to expect. So let's start with the very first tier. Now this one starts with a man named Raymond Gibby. He owns a bronze sculpting company called Gibby Bronze. And he was awarded the contract to sculpt the bronze statues for to commemorate the Eagles' most uh, recent Super Bowl win. He wanted to leverage the publicity this event um, created, so he reached out to a local agency who contacted me to create the media assets to run um, in the campaign. Now, Raymond is really the, br the brand behind his company, so it made sense to have him on camera, even though he didn't love the idea. And through this, he simply talks about what he does and how that would fit into the viewer's life. We're trying to go for authenticity in this ad um, with just simple cuts, a focus on a few pieces of his work. Um, we were, however, inhibited by the fact that the only media I had to work with to showcase any large presentation of a, a commemoration of a large important figure was captured with cell phone pictures. So you'll see a big jump in, in video quality down to there, but our thinking was that we were going through it for authenticity, so this would actually work okay. So without further ado, let's take a look at this ad for Gibby Bronze. My name is Raymond Gibby. I create custom bronze sculptures that immortalize amazing people and magnificent animals. Some of these can be seen in places like the Philadelphia Eagles Stadium with the coach and quarterback who helped them win their first ever Super Bowl but most of my work is within the walls of those who love and respect art. I'd love to help you immortalize those special moments and people in your life. Just click on the link below. So the next level up includes a whole bunch of other things, mostly writing script and handling pre-production, um, all the planning process behind making this thing work, work perfectly. So I've got two examples for this price tier. And for both of these, actually, the client needed an extremely fast turnaround of only a few days to create the entire thing. And a quick turnaround, I have to say, really wouldn't have been possible if the client needed a lot of time going back and forth and deciding on concepts or revisions. So the best way to go was to leave those decisions to me. Um, it required a lot of trust on their end, but I was grateful that they were able to do that because we were able to create something faster, um, better, and just smoother than they could have ever done themselves. And it was also for a much lower budget actually. Um, so normally ads like this start in the $5,000 range, but in these two particular ads, they were far less. Um, again, because the client was able to um, let go of some of that control and it allowed me to be more efficient. I spent less time and so I build them less money. So the first ad is for Power Chats. Um, they gain most of their business through uh, conventions. 
Um, and so they had an opportunity to share an ad on the big screen at the largest convention of the year. Um, and their ad was received extremely well. The call to action on this ad was for them to go visit their booth at this convention. But we also created a web version that they could use to run on Facebook ads or YouTube ads that would direct them to their website. So you're gonna see the website version, so let's take a look. Your website is bleeding customers. What are you doing to stop them from leaving? We have clients who have added as much as 100,000 in monthly revenue just from installing this new technology. It's an automated chat box that we've engineered to allow your customers to quickly interact with and book their appointment. It's completely customizable, but most importantly, proven. It's proven to book at least 70% of inquiries versus only 30% with live chat or standard web forms and has become a huge revenue boost for our clients. To add thousands each month to your business, go to powerchats.com. The second ad is for a women's shoe company. Now their product is a very specific women's shoe whose top strap is interchangeable. So you can slide it out and slide it back in and try on different looks. So you can do, I think, 11 or 12 different top strap pieces. Now they wanted to show off the variety of their shoe and that you can change it in and out. And they also wanted to have it just be kind of fun, lively, bold colors, all of that kind of stuff. Um, however, because the turnaround time was so quick, um, normally I would hire actors or, or uh, uh, models for this kind of thing, but we didn't have time for that. So all I had was the shoes to work with. And so um, let's take a look at what we ended up creating for that. So that one went great. So far it's been the most clicked ad um, that they've ever run. So that's always great to hear. And uh, now we can jump into the last tier. Um, and I'm gonna share this one because, this specific example, because I have behind the scenes photos of the production. Um, and this is gonna be, give you a better idea of what's involved in producing a TV broadcast spot that can also be repurposed for um, a 20 second ad for YouTube or Facebook. Now I was actually hired to shoot the behind the scenes photos, which is why I have them. So I thought this would be a perfect example to show a lot of the behind the scenes stuff of what's involved, how many people are there on set. And then we can take a look at the actual ad itself. And so this was an ad that was run for the holiday season in 2019. Here you can see we had set creation. There was a DIT director, producer, client. We had hair, makeup, actors, full grip crew, craft services, the whole gamut. We had focus pullers. We had pretty much everybody there. And yeah, so let's take a look at the ad. For Grumps, the holidays can feel like the dumps. Doesn't all this good cheer? He asked. Just hurt your ears. But from time to time, <laughs> something changes their mind. I feel sad. She said. You can feel cheer instead. You might be right. So he got the card in a tree and his cheer grew by three. <laughs> Get your Mountain America rewards card today for three times the cheer this holiday. Okay, so lastly, this is an ad that ran on CBS, NBC, Fox, ABC, ESPN, all nationwide. Uh, I traveled to three different states together to film it with uh, Kinetto Pictures, um, and uh, I ran one of the cameras. So this ad was edited by an agency out of LA called Black Ops, and my hope is that this gives you a glimpse into how much of a team sport it is when you get into larger size productions. Um, really, you have a person for every role, and 
Um, it makes for, um, it gives you the ability to do bigger things, to create sets, to have full actors, to have make sure everybody is watching every element so it, it ends up being perfect. When a fire is going on, you're not thinking clearly, so they called the fire department for us. I could hear crackling in the walls. My mind went totally blank. All I remember saying was, my boyfriend's beating me, and she took it from there. And all of this occurred in four minutes or less. I am grateful we all made it out safely. People you don't know care about you. It's kind of one of those things where you can't even thank somebody. To protect what you love, call 1-800-ADT-CARES. The larger productions are really a big team sport, which is one of the reasons they can be really expensive. Um, if you want to be efficient and nimble with quick turnarounds, you really should plan on hitting around that $5,000 um, tier. Um, and if you want to save some money, you can spend less by handling some of the production yourself. So it gives you a lot of options to be really flexible and, and get something that's really going to be great and represent your company really great. So if you'd like to reach out to me for a bid or even just with basic questions, feel free to follow the link below. And I really look forward to connecting to you guys.